Hey guys, Chris with Up North Air Gunner. Okay, so hey, I wanna show you a project that uh, I have been working on over the last few months. Uh, Donnie from Donnie FL has uh, recently released his uh, Air Force Texan and Air Force Air Guns adapters for his absolutely awesome suppressors. Um, so yeah, he's got an entire line out now for the Air Force Texans, Condors, Talons, Talon Peas, Escapes. Basically, if you've got an Air Force air gun, he's got an adapter and definitely has a suppressor that'll work with your gun. So obviously, of all the uh, suppressor adapters we worked on, the, uh, the Air Force Texan line was pretty awesome because when you put an Emperor on a uh, Texan, so it definitely quiets it down a lot. So one of the coolest adapters that he came out with is the one for the Talon P, or it could actually work on any of the SS model uh, Air Force air guns where the barrel is recessed into the frame. Uh, so in the Air Force air guns, they come with a baffling uh, suppression system, which is absolutely awesome. But on the Talon P there, it just, the barrel goes right pretty much to the end of the frame and there's no suppression on the end. It makes for a very nice compact uh, pistol or set it up as a carbine. But if you wanna put any kind of um, suppression on there, uh, really you needed a good adapter. And so this adapter is absolutely awesome. So I just really wanted to kind of go over it a little bit with you real quick. Um, it, it makes the Talon P look freaking amazing. So this is the Donnie FL Ronin. And this is the, actually this is the big bore version. So this one was um, made by Donnie to work with the big bores. If you want, don't want the uh, Emperor, which extends out probably another three or four inches, you can go for a more compact version. This does a very good job. The Emperor, I think, is definitely the way to go if you're shooting a Texan. But if you're shooting a really loud uh, air gun, let's say like an Air Force Condor, you know, the Talon P is super loud um, just because there's no suppression from the factory. And it's got this direct flow valve, which is um, very, very powerful, which is going to make a lot of uh, bang. So which is actually going to be pretty loud as well. So um, I'm going to do some before and afters with this just so you can hear the difference. And I'll tell you what, this paired with that makes this the ultimate backpack gun. I mean, if you break this down, you take this off, you, you break it down just to the, um, the frame in the bottle. I mean, you're only talking about, what is that, 22 to 24 inches. So if you've got a large backpack, that'll fit perfectly. So um, but yeah, let's do some uh, befores and afters uh, with the Talon P suppressed with a new uh, Talon P adapter. Here we go. So here's the Talon P set up without the suppressor. Normally the Talon P adapter from Donnie FL comes with a really nice knurled uh, covering here, but I just pulled it off and we'll shoot it without that. This is definitely pretty loud without any kind of suppression. So here we go. Okay, so pretty loud. I mean, not as loud as let's say a Texan or a Condor. But it's, uh, it's still pretty loud. If you try to shoot this in your backyard, your, your neighbors would know. So um, yeah, let's try it. Uh, let's put the suppressor on it and see how it does. All right, here we go. Talon P, suppressed. Donnie FL Ronin, quiet. You just hear the hammer, that's it. Just the hammer and nothing else. You hear that? That's it. Tink! <laughs> Just a little metallic sound and that's all you got. All right, there it is, Donnie FL, Ronin on the Talon P with the new Talon P uh, Air Force adapter. Definitely go out and get one of these. Um, I'm super excited now that he's got adapters for all the Air Force Air Guns line. It totally opens up a whole world of suppressors and muzzle brakes. So I have noticed when I either put on a muzzle brake or uh, one of Donnie's suppressors, it does tighten up the shot groups a bit. I'm not sure if it's acting as a, like an air stripper or knocking down some of the turbulence around the muzzle, I'm not sure, but it definitely tightens up the groups a little bit. So um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Go out and get one of these and uh, yeah, thanks for joining me.